Amsterdam calling. So pick up. Art Deco is a particular design style that became popular in the 1920s and 1930s. Combining traditional craftsmanship with modernist styles, the Art Deco look represents luxury, richness and technological progress. There are many beautiful examples of Art Deco architecture and interior design in Amsterdam. During the 1920s and 30s was the beginning of the golden age of movies and ornate movie palaces in the opulent Art Deco style were popping up everywhere around the US and Europe. And the Tuschinski Theater, right here in Amsterdam, is no exception. The theater was built in 1921 by owner Abraham Tuschinski, who hired architects to build his dream cinema at a cost of 4 million guilders. Besides deco, you can also see Art Nouveau influences and elements from the Dutch Amsterdam School of Architecture in its design. Wow, just look at how incredibly ornate this lobby is. I love the decorations on the wall and the lamps are just amazing. An example of Art Deco are the two peacocks up there. They represent beauty and immortality. In fact, there are peacocks everywhere. Wow, this is just stunning. thing to see here in the main room is the ceiling lamp. It represents the inside of a peacock tail. Another thing that is striking is that Abram Tuschinski did not like pillars, so your view is never obstructed. I'm here on the main stage and this is exactly where the orchestra used to play during the movies in the old days. Now they also had a Wallitzer organ that is actually below the stage and they would bring it up during the performance. What is great is that they have these little private balconies with love scenes just for two. How romantic is that? Oh my god, just see how amazing the view is from up here. Look at how many balcony rows there are and how steep. When you go and see a movie here, you get more than just a cinematic experience. The spectacular interior takes you back in time and you have the feeling you're at a grand premiere a hundred years ago. When the theater first opened, there was even a cabaret and a Japanese tea room. Now, although those are gone, it's great to see that some of the original furnishings are still here, such as this bar. When the theater opened, this was in fact the backstage area, and only in 1977 they turned it into a VIP room. Welcome to the Tuschinski, sir. What can I get you? You can really see why the Tuschinski Theatre is the theater of choice for Dutch movie premieres and other cinema related events as it is the most iconic piece of Art Deco architecture in Amsterdam. If you want to learn more about the theater yourself, you can take an audio tour. They have audio tours every morning before the first film. I am Sander Oudkerk for Amsterdam Calling. If you've liked this video, please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to your YouTube channel. See you next time!